this message is for you. That's why you are seeing this. Come on in here to your spiritual nourishment. I am your shaman empress, aka the shaman hummingbird. This is your general message. All right, so only take what is for you and simply leave what is not. Make sure that you are subscribed to your areas. Only placements love tarot. All right. If you need to know where Aries is in your chart, cafeastrology.com. Any placements, any things with your chart that you need to know, please take advantage of that as well. Okay. Um, sun, moon, rising, Venus, north node, third party, sun, moon, and rising. Okay. Let's go. Let's see what is going on with you guys. This message is for you. That's why you are here. So let's see what is going on. Messages for the collective. All my beautiful universe and Holy Spirit. What are the messages for the collective? Messages for the collective, please. All my beautiful universe and Holy Spirit. What are the messages for the collective? What are the messages for the collective? What are the messages for the collective, please? Mm. Things are getting distance between, oh, things are getting distance between you and this person now that they have caught feelings. Now that this, somebody wants to work on it, now that they have caught feelings for you, um, they could have felt like too much time has gotten in between, yep. And you could have changed, you could be discerned, or maybe you could be looking at them differently. All right, messages for the collective. All my beautiful universe and Holy Spirit, show me energy. Let me see here, please. Seven of Cups. There's confusion. Yeah. See, this person, because of the time, they could be now wondering um, how to come forward. They feel like they should. They feel the spirit um, between you guys. They feel um, the spiritual connection. All right. They could even be um, asking their ancestors or talking to their spiritual team about options. God, give me some options. What should I do here between me and my person? You know, uh, grandma, my grandma was here. If my grandpa was here, um, they would give me directions on how to move. Sorry, guys. Spiritual hiccups and burps there. We got aqua areas and we have scorpion. Yeah, there's a lot of pressure and this person feels stuck. But the thing is, they've been having a lot of enlightenment, even though they feel stuck, even though they feel pressure. They feel pressure. Um, the Ten of Wands is also hooked up to the House of Virgo. So this is somebody that's dealing with stress, anxiety a little bit. Um, irritation. They're irritated. Someone here, because they're in the hangman. Oh, look at all these cards that popped up for you. We got the Knight of Cups. We got the Queen of Wands. We got the Six of Cups. And we have the Two of Coins. And this is because of whatever happened in the past that made them juggle you. Someone here doesn't even remember about like what could have made them juggle you in the past. It's like, why did I... Oh my gosh, the two of wands, the shit, decisions, areas, energy, like what was I on? What was, it's like, child, you know, we in that Mercury retrograde energy, child. Damn it. All right. Let's and go. that new uh, year is coming in. We got the nine of wands in the moon cart and we're in a full moon energy. Cancerian. Um, this person's hurt. This is somebody here that's in a lot of pain. Mm-hmm. Or this is you. This person juggles back and forth a lot on what happened and why they juggled you. Someone here, you know how you um, get mad at somebody and it's like, at that time it was war and roses and now that they're over it, they don't even remember it. Like, I must have been... Someone here is like, damn, I must have been really tripping or on some shit or... Someone here is also realizing how far their temper takes them when the will of fortune shows itself. And they don't know what to say. It's like they're lost. They don't know what they were thinking, neither. That's why there's no swords here. They're hiding their swords because they don't... They're trying to understand their intellect. Why do they make these decisions or even what led them to make this decision? I feel like you are 
the Queen of Wands. That's that Aries Pisces energy. This person is uh, in the Knight of Cups. Aquarius. Aqua Aries of Pisces. Hmm. So this person, so they 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 want to create. Now to be honest with you, someone here wants to secretly. Is this is a secret? They could want to keep the fact that you guys are connecting, the fact that they are trying to um, open up to you a secret. They don't want everybody to know. Um, it could break. If someone here is if they're hiding something. This is someone here that wants to secretly connect with you, even though it's been a minute, even though it's been a while. Um, they're kind of over it. They could remember certain things. It could be very fragmented on their intellectual uh, level of what the issue was in the past between both of you guys again that made this decision to juggle you. All right, but they are wanting to connect. But someone here is like they don't want everybody to know that they're connecting with you. This is some kind of bird. Somebody here said something. That's why they're hiding their swords. It's almost, if it's making me feel like they don't want to feel or look stupid. Because the queen of swords showed herself, but she's not here. So did the royal card. Yep, here's the swords. And the six of swords showed itself. So they want to come towards you in, 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 in secret. Yeah, they do. It's their wish fulfillment. This is someone here that knows they portrayed you. That's why they want to keep it a secret. Mm -hmm. The star card, the eight of pentacles, and a death card. Someone here got five of wands. This is someone here, to be honest with you. Somebody here wants to keep it a secret and work on it silently. Um, this is somebody that wants to connect. They don't want everybody to know it. In case it don't work out, they don't look stupid. In case it don't work out, they don't feel stupid. They don't have to explain it to everybody else. They don't want to look dumb. They don't want to look like... This is somebody here that could feel like they owe you something. But it has... In case it don't work out, that's why they want to keep it quiet. This, this person is hiding that they were hurt. And they know that they hurt you. This is a people pleaser. As well. Alright, let's get this angel number so we can go a little deeper um, into this thing with you guys. So we have six, two, two. I'm seven. All right, that's what we're going to rock with. Okay, angel number two, two, six, seven, eight, eleven on the timer as we go into this. Um, this is a sign from the angels that you are capable of achieving your dreams and goals if you put in hard work, focus on positive thoughts. Someone here, this is somebody here that know that you or the Queen of Wands, you are really feisty. You might go off and put them in their place. That's why they want to work on this on secret. They don't want you cussing their ass out, standing your ground, or really showing. They don't want others to know that you checked them. This is somebody here that kind of wants to... This is why they want to keep it a secret until they feel like they can gain control with all these wands here. And to be honest with you, there is something here that this person is keeping a secret with other people. This is someone here that could also still secretly date. So it could be a combination of things that, while they're making this decision. This is someone here that's immature. They're a knight. Mm -hmm. And this is also someone here that's they know how to manipulate their cups. This is the knight of cups. Very creative person. Someone here also wants to kind of, you know... I hate to say this, but how they're telling me, it's like training you in private. They know you you don't give a damn. And you're going to say no, uh, no. This is why they could be nervous to bring you around like friends or some shit like that. This is also someone that could like compare you to other people.
Someone here could feel like is this is somebody here that could have like real opinionated friends or something. With the seven of cups and the ten of wands. This is a people pleaser. They want to people please. And for some of you guys, um, they, they could have gained something like this from their mom or mom's side of, of the family. What's going on? I want to see what they're hiding. What's the moon court? This is also someone that's hiding the fact that they're juggling money. This is also someone here because of the karma they're getting behind this connection with you. They're also hiding how much they're really attracted to you. Someone here is a control freak. Mm -hmm. That's why they want to keep this on the low. This is also someone here. That, yeah, they don't even like other people knowing their moves. They move secretly. This person moves a certain kind of way. This is a very creative person. This mother may not know how sneaky their own son or daughter is. Some of you guys drive a white vehicle. The sun was shining where you were today. What's this person hiding? It could have just rained where you guys was at or something. The nine of swords. Oh, they're nervous. Oh, they're nervous about this ten of cups. Six of wands. Seven of swords. They're sneaky as hell. They're nervous. Oh, they're nervous about, about oh yeah. To take action. They're nervous. King of Wands, Two of Wands, and the Nine of Wands. Of you finding out how they really feel. King of Swords and the Ace of Cups. Because the, the King of Swords also uh, rules intellect. Yeah, and and to be honest with you, this is someone here. Um, when when feelings start getting attached, this person this person has rules. When feelings start getting attached or too deep, they um, they'll end it or they start pushing away. Yep, four swords. They'll fall back. Yeah, this can also be like a strategy or something like that. I want to see these seven of cups. This is also someone here that has the fact that they have other options. They could have did this to other people, but they have options. And they've been hiding this. For some of you guys, they've been hiding this or feeling like this for the last six to seven months. Yeah. Mm -hmm. These are a lot of wands here. What's the seven of cups? What's the seven of cups? What's the seven of cups? This is also someone here. They hide, They know how to hide shit, but they don't know how to... Okay, this person knows how to hide their emotion as well. They'll act out of their emotion first, but they hide their truth the best. What's the Seven of Cups? Someone here smoke a lot of weed. Get a Four of Cups. Oh, this person's not happy with these other options. No, they're not. Look at this. This King of Cups. They're not happy with these other options. Ooh. So for some of you guys, this is somebody, this is the king and the queen of cups. Now, I'm getting two energies. Now, for some of you guys, this is someone here that is not happy with these other options. And they feel like it, it, they should have just opened up their cup more to you. Others of you guys, this is someone that's not, they could have chosen another option. And blocked you. 
and they're not happy with it. And this is someone here that they had feelings for. Yep, they did. 4-1. They could have moved in with this person for some of you guys. Or they're over their house all the fucking time. Yep, the Ace of Wands. Yeah. Oh, child. Oh, shit. And the sex ain't good. Damn. Damn it. Um, to be honest with you, this is somebody here that's mad because the sex ain't good neither. And it's like... <laughs> so it's all bad. Yeah, and they're not... Oh, yeah. Now they're like mad that they ended this and didn't make you an offer but blocked you and had this new start. That's what they did. And they thought this was sneaky, clever, but the best thing to do. And now they don't want it. It's, they don't feel the same. They want to talk. <laughs> and they want to talk about these options and what they did or something. Damn, y'all. I mean, I what's the six... Oh, what came over? The nine of wands. Oh, oh, that was the nine of wands. Someone here wants to defend their secrets. So they kept all this from you, but now they want to explain yourself. Yep, they do. And they're very passionate about it. And you still turn this person on. But I'm going to tell you right now, and they it's the sex too. Damn. Damn it. Oh, yeah, they've been thinking about this, baby. Oh, shit, the king of wands in the night. Oh, child. Oh, and they've been thinking about this. Some of you guys, this person has what dreams. Damn. This person plays with they self when they think about you. Mm -hmm. Honey, somebody here, I mean, it's for a long time, too. Someone here wants a long time. They got something they want to prove off their chest. Oh, wait a minute. Hold up. Oh, shit. Someone here likes to, um... Now, someone here likes to have sex with their hat on. Or they don't even take their hat off. Mm-mm. <laughs> okay. Uh, damn. Okay, wait. Let me look at this person. What's this Knight of Cups? It was you and other options here. But they did have a particular option they went for, they felt for, but it didn't play out. Their sex ain't good, and they compared the sex to yours. Your sex is like everything to this person. What's the Knight of Cups? Damn. Yep, it is. The Queen of Wands. Damn. They just keep, yup, the Seven of Cups. Oh, my gosh. Did someone here also, oh, my gosh. I can't even do this right now, y'all, for real. Ooh, I'm getting hot, child. Let me take off my little old child. So, this person has you in their head when it does other people. Whether this is a man or a woman, I'm going to just tell you right now. Yep, because you're the wish fulfillment, and that's what they think about. Yeah. Yep, that's the truth. They think about y'all, the decisions they made. They think about how it could have been you, should be you, all this shit. Yep. Three of Pentacles and a Six of Swords and a Joker. Mm. Yep, they, I mean, they are stuck on you. Someone here could also want to spend a ban on you. Ten of Pentacles as well. Damn. Ten of Cups. They think about you guys being in the house, everything. It, so they played house with somebody else. It, yes, it had other options. Now, this is somebody here. Um, one second, guys. Yes, 1910, 1910, baby. On the timer as I pause the video. This person, it's like when they're with these other people, they're playing house, they do all these things, and they sit up there, they can't help but wonder, I wonder what it would be like if you were there. I wonder what it would be like if I did this, you know, it's like they'll be doing whatever they are with this other person. Damn, I wonder if how it would have been like if they had you there or if you were there, would we do this or what I it's like they think about this shit a lot. Hmm. Damn. Um what's this one? 
I want to see this Ten of Wands. Oh, when I said that certain cards start going sideways, y'all. What's the Ten of Wands? Didn't I? Oh, this person. They put burden. They someone here realized, yep, that they put burdens on their own self, yep, because they could have had a lot with you. Someone here, um, they realize they have a contract with you as well. You guys could be soulmates or something like that. Yep, this is the Queen of Swords in reverse. This person should have offered you something big, but they feel like you know they could have kind of ruined this. Yeah. Now they're trying to figure out how to fix their sister pentacles. What could they do? Offer time, money, strategy, yep, strategy, yeah. Because they have feelings for you. It's a cup. This person's falling in love with you or has fallen in love with you. We are in Mercury retrograde, so <laughs> I always tell you guys pay attention to how the planets line up because that is how the readings are going to um come out, right? On what planets are affecting the energies in the atmospheres, guys. Now, some of you guys be laying these laces down, honey. Them waves is popping. Yeah. All right, let's see what's going on here. Oh, my goodness, the universe. Oh, my spirits. Oh, thank you. Yeah, uh-huh. This is somebody that's stubborn as hell. They ain't no more. Someone here has realized they have to get out their own way, too. Yep, they're stressed. Beef out. Do you understand? Hold on. Boom. They are stressed out. Because they put this, they curse yourself when they put this burden on their self with you. Yep, nightmares. Yeah, I told you. They're, they think it's like it kind of haunts them as well. Yep, they, they do. And they think about all of this. Actually, this is someone here that is wishing. They could be also in your energy real crazy, real strong. I was saying that earlier in the reading. Mm -hmm. Yeah, oh yeah, honey, they're bullying you spiritually. They are. For some of you guys, this person extra projects to your house. <laughs> oh shit, they do. Yeah, they do. At a certain time, they could be begging you spiritually. Yup. Oh, they. Could, this person's crying. Because they lost you. This could be at night. Mm. Um, child. Let's see what this person's feelings and emotions is towards you right now. Yeah, uh, uh, you triggered them. Or they feel like they triggered you. And now you're like, fuck them. This is also someone here that said fuck you before, too, so you know that. Yep. They was mad. All right. What is this person's feeling that I'm not sure sort of collective? It's like they're mad at their self, and it's easier to kind of blame you and be mad at you. It could be easier to cope with. Yep. See, you still look like a snack. Yep, I saw this. So, some of you guys are store seeds. And you look good. Yep, and they're jealous. They're jealous about you having other connections or um, you with other people. Yep, and I told you, they talk shit. And this is someone here, to be honest with you, they were in a very dark... They were dealing with their dark shadow when they were connecting with you. This is why they acting all crazy. They could be going through a dark night of the shadow right now or another... Um, extension in it because there is levels to it even when you're doing shadow work you guys know you it's just like oh I, I did my shadow work I'm done no there you you have the shadow work to do it's levels to it uh, for some of you guys you might want to look in your chart and you can you'll see where you need to work work on as well that will also help this person could be in another part of their shadow what else is here? No friends with benefits. I'm ready to be your dope ass husband. Damn, y'all. I'm telling you. Mercury retrograde is whooping that ass. A lot of people's ass. They're getting their ass handed to them. Wow. Some of you guys could have had a tree house. Some of you uh, kids could have been like talking shit on your little tree house, but it was cute when you was little or something like that. 
family members was hating. Oh, uh, they was jealous of you when you were uh, a child. So you could have jealous family members. Some of you guys had a nice house. You could have had a tree house or like even one of them like little playhouses you buy. Your family would come over, but they was talking shit. They, that's because they were jealous of you, so you know that. Some of you guys might already know that was this here. Yep, you was privileged. For some of you guys, you're innocent. Your purity stands out. People are jealous of that. It's your energy. Oh, shit. It's your damn twin flame, child. Wow. You know this is a twin flame soulmate channel, baby. Oop. That's all they wanted you to know. For a lot of you guys, this is a twin flame. If it's not, then you guys know. Um, if you're not a twin flame, then it's definitely your soulmate. Now, for some of you guys that are twin flames, you already, you still have soulmates. So, if you know you're a twin flame, then it's your twin flame. Not your soulmate. Everybody's not a twin flame, but everybody does have soulmates. Even your friends, I always keep us spiritually updated. So, I'm a repeater of words. All right, guys. So, you know. Um, or, you know, your friends. You build relationships with them. You do life with them. You cry with them, right? What's the love oracle messages? And then we're going to get you some letters too. What's the, um, mm, thank you. Love oracle romantic night. I can't make this up. This person is astro projecting to you at night. For, for this is, a, I should have known that it was a twin flame for a lot of you guys. Some of you guys sleep with each other at night. Mm-hmm. Uh, let's let, okay, first of all, it's married souls. This is your soul's other half. It's always going to find its other half. So when you are going to sleep, your soul literally could be going to go find its other, its counterpart. Mm -hmm. It's peaceful there. Someone here could want to take you out. Yeah, they want to catch you out or something like that. Protection is kindness. Someone here wants to protect you, this union. Someone here could now want to protect this, like, twin flame energy that you guys have for a lot of you guys. Um, so, if you are a soulmate, you could be getting more of, like, telekinesis part of this. For the twin flames, you're definitely getting that Astros. This person's having Astro sex with you too, by the way. Uh, they're showing me the intimacy card. Mm -hmm. This person, just, they want intimacy with you. This is someone here at night. I might have Astro sex. Other nights, they might come and hold you and sleep. This is spiritual. Wake up. Y'all wake up. Mmm. It's, yeah, I, I, I would get a little deeper into that, but it, it, the reading will be like way too long. So we have the fourth choir. Yep, Spirit and God's divine love. It's your energy, your privilege, love and light, your tears. Your tears have healed you as well. I, East Side, a city, state, town, country, or in, yep, this is a contract. Yeah, and a contract. Yep, here it is. Yeah, contract card. This is a contract. Mm hmm. Yeah. We have Archangel, uh, I like to say Satil. Some people say, you know, it different. That's okay. Worship and contemplation. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's who they. So some of you guys, they could be uh, um, connecting. They could be like S and praying. We saw that uh, vow card. I don't feel like pulling it back out <laughs> or going through all it. Yep, here it is right here. And connecting to the angelics. Now, for some of you guys, you could have played during this person since a child. Your twin flame could have friend zoned you. The eighth choir, Prince Chief and his army, Archangel Michael, baby. Yeah. N Z. Alright. Uh-huh. Yeah. They said Z's. Like when you're sleeping. Is what I'm getting, what I'm seeing. And I'm seeing sheep. Mm.
Um, someone here, child, this person is deep as hell. Your twin flame is on something. This person is woke. This is also someone here that checks in to see if you're laying down yet. They know when you're in the bed. Let's say this person's tired and they try to connect with you. They know when you're not in the... Yup. Mm-hmm. They just confirmed that for me. They know when you're in the bed or not. And they'll wait. And they'll check again. Child, y'all been on that deep shit this week. And we got that full moon Cancerian energy. Oh, the new year energy is coming in. All right, what's the oracle messages here? Mm, this is... Oh, shit. Message for a rabbit. Service to the animal world. This person here is uh, connected to you through their familiars. Now, you know bunnies. That's why it's, they're highly used in magic because of messages. Messages for a rabbit. Um, they said don't say that, so I'm not. I don't want YouTube to hurt me, child, okay? So, when they tell me, nope, not that, mm-mm. So I, I can't say that part, but okay. Also, that's why they're used in magic. And what is magic? I always tell you. Magic is what? A manipulation of energy. <laughs> Wake up. I can't make this up. This person wakes up with you. They said almost every night. So this is not every night, but almost every night. So that's a lot of nights. No need to fear, but there's, there's nothing to be scared about here. Yeah. This person doesn't want you to be scared. This could be also someone here that's preparing you now so when they come back around you're already kind of used to it. This, this person is well aware of all of this by the way. Well let's get your signs and planets honey because y'all oh baby okay what's the signs and planets here? What's the signs and planets for the collective? Now for some of you guys you're familiar your bunny, um, could have had, if you had a pet bunny, you could have had a pink eye bunny, or you could have just saw like a pink eye, red eye bunny, is what I'm getting. You're familiar. Am I, can I say that? No, they don't want me to say that neither. They said get off of it. Okay. Pluto. Yeah, they're, they're, I gotta leave that alone. There's, that's not for YouTube for some reason. Okay, so we got Scorpion and oh, they cussing me out. They said you, it ain't for. I mean, okay, it's it's not that not for some reason. There is a reason. That's what they just said. I, I gotta say. So there is a reason why they we cannot put this on YouTube. The part with that part. Thank you. Love you. Okay. Uh. Um. Um. Um, Sectarius, thank you. And Arius. Oh, yeah. See, this is a rebirth. Pluto's about resurrection. It's about rebirth. Okay? Um, and they told me Pluto was going to come out. Um, this person, this person was woke. Yeah. And they're healing. They have healed some things, but not all things. This is also someone here that knows that there's unfinished business. They're mad, though. They're angry. Yep, Venus. Oh. You soothe this person. There is no other planet that can soothe or calm down more. It's like Venus. They're counterparts. Twin flames. <laughs> so to speak. Um, there, I mean, there's other energies that can cool him down, but not cal calm him. Venus. Honey. You're Venus to this person. They're Mars to you. Or this is vice versa. Yeah. Uh-uh. Yup. And they're going to contract again and firebenders. So I'm talking to twin flames that are Arius, Leo, Sectarius. Yeah, you're home to this person. Mm. Ooh, child. Well, I feel like this is a lot of confirmation. This is a confirmation reading for a lot of you guys.
All right, I love you all. Stay dope. I hope this helps you out in more ways than one. Hit that bell. Hit all on your way out, baby. All right, so you are staying tuned in, tapped in, and you will also be notified when your messages are ready and available for you. I love you with your dope ass. Next video upload. I'll share your name, mom.